Well, this is going to be a little review on professional baseball played in Winston-Salem, uh, Greensboro, North Carolina area. Last night, uh, we went and saw the third team that plays at High Point. And so I just want to give my little personal review on uh, the three teams and the three stadiums. First of all, Winston-Salem team is an A-plus league um, called the Winston-Salem Dash in a fairly new, pretty new stadium, very nice, and fairly easy to get to. Uh, the second one we've been to is Greensboro uh, Grasshoppers, and that's located in Greensboro, easy to get to. Uh, parking is less accessible, but it's there and it's fairly expensive. Brand new stadium, very nice little stadium. And the third one last night that we went to was the High Point Rockers uh, in downtown High Point, North Carolina. Uh, stadium was just completed at the beginning of the season. Very nice, easy parking, and expensive uh, parking, or inexpensive parking. So what I want to do is my review is going to combine both the, the stadiums, the parking, and the pricing, and then I'm going to rate them and give you a little reason why. Uh, the High Point Rockers are non-affiliated uh, in a non-affiliated league, so they're not their team is not officially associated with Major League Baseball. All these players have either played in minor league systems or professional baseball at at some time, and now are at this point in their life. Uh, so the number three team, which I consider the third lowest would be Winston-Salem. Very nice stadium. A uh, little expensive as far as concessions. Parking is pretty nice. Uh, about $10, $11. Uh, but I would rate it third. Second I'm going to rate is going to be Greensboro. Again, a, pretty much a brand new stadium. Very nice stadium. Concessions are a little cheaper than uh, at uh, Winston-Salem, but overall, it's a good location, fairly easy parking, a good setup. But the one that I rate number one is uh, High Point. Uh, and of the three stadiums, it's the smallest of three stadiums. Winston-Salem being the largest, Greensboro being not far behind it, but then uh, number three would be uh, High Point. And it's a smaller stadium, brand new, very nice. It does not have as much concession space as the three. Greensboro has the most concession space uh, of the three. Parking is right next to the stadium. Uh, as of uh, July 2019, parking is $3. And there's still plenty of free parking uh, right next to the stadium also. Uh, I was very impressed with the stadium. It's smaller. Uh, it wasn't overbuilt. It's not a stadium that, on an average day, you know, ha or average game, half the seats are going to be empty. It's a stadium that, on an average game, you know, at least three quarters of the seats are going to be occupied. So they didn't spend money building a stadium where half the seats in the stadium are going to be used uh, most of the time. So. If you're living in the Winston-Salem, Greensboro, High Point area of North Carolina and are interested in going to see professional baseball, my first choice would be the High Point Rockers. Second of all, I would pick the Greensboro Grasshoppers. And then third, I would pick the Winston-Salem Dash. All three are good choices. All three are good baseball entertainment if you live in this area. And pretty much uh, what might dictate which one you pick is where you live. Uh, if you live west of the uh, Winston-Salem, Greensboro area, you're probably going to pick Winston-Salem Dash. It's easier to get to. If you live in Greensboro or east of Greensboro, uh, you're probably going to pick the Grasshoppers again because it's easiest to get, uh, get to. And right between the two, between Greensboro and Winston-Salem is High Point 
and uh, it's just as easy whether you live in the Greensboro area, or High Point area, or what's the Salem area. But those are my choices. I pick High Point first. I pick uh, Greensboro second, and Winston Salem uh, third. All good choices. All good entertainment for the family. Hope this helps.